Mitsubishi has confirmed that the Shogun Sport SUV will return to the UK market early in 2018. Over a decade since the departure of the previous model from the UK market, as revealed by Auto Express earlier this year, it will sit between the Outlander and the full-size Shogun, with a price tag around £30,000 looking likely. It'll follow the all-new Eclipse Cross crossover into showrooms, which is scheduled to land on sale in Britain in January. We reported that the SUV could return to UK showrooms in 2015, when the company's UK managing director Lance Bradley replied to a tweet from Auto Express, claiming that it was far from impossible that the Shogun Sport could be homologated and converted for European release at a later date. As you can see, the front-end design of the Asian market Pajaro Sport, which will take on the Shogun Sport name in the UK, is similar to the facelifted Outlander SUV. It's Mitsubishi's new family face, which also appears on its headline act for Geneva 2017 the Eclipse Cross SUV. The model is based on the platform of the new L200, and the pickup routes are visible side-on and inside, with a similar ride height and door profile, plus a cabin inspired by the firm's pickup. A large rear overhang translates into seven full-size seats and a huge boot, while the back end gets unusual stretch tail lamps. Under the bonnet, UK buyers will be offered a 2.4-litre four-cylinder diesel engine producing 178 bhp and 430 newton meters of torque, sending power to a selectable all-wheel drive system via an 8-speed automatic gearbox. Features such as hill descent control, trailer assist and hill start assist will be standard equipment in the UK. Two trim levels will be offered in Britain. Both will feature leather seats as standard, alongside keyless entry in a starter button, LED daytime running light, and an infotainment system fitted with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. The as yet unnamed range topping model will built on this with heated leather seats and a suite of driver assists, including a forward collision warning system, blind spot assist, and a 360-degree camera setup linked to the infotainment display. Prices will be confirmed closer to the car's UK launch.